Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Dark Siders 2 in the last episode. Who got our first death? It only took two episodes to get murdered. And hopefully we can avoid that this time. Now, granted, here, here's... This is a level-based system. Okay, and I don't know if it's like Borderlands where the enemies level up with you. It completely possibly may be. Okay, okay, I got you. I got you, game. So I just need to avoid that at all costs. That, uh, that thing he puts in the ground. This thing. I need to avoid it. Uh, dude. Well, no. Maybe it doesn't do that much damage. Well, I haven't figured it out yet. I'm, I let, let me try to wrap my mind around this. What? No. No, 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 no. 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 It's impossible. He did one hit. One hit. It's a one hit kill, man. It's his hands. It's, it's a bunch of wood and some rocks. There's nothing special about this thing. And he hits me one time. The f One of the four horsemen? Death himself? Can get killed by woods and stone? No! Or stone and... Stones and wood versus... You know, I, I can't talk. I don't know who I am. That's okay. I'm trying this one more time. If we can't do this, man. If we can't kill this mother lover, I don't know what we're gonna do, boy. We're, we're gonna get crazy. We're gonna... We're gonna break... We're gonna hack the game. We're gonna put this disc in a... If I can just figure out how to outrun it. Oh, I did. I did. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, yeah, you got that. But see, like, that doesn't do any damage. So, like, that's good news, right? Like, it's it's that I need to avoid. It's his the attacks that he uses in his hand that I need to avoid. I mean, yes, I do need to avoid this. But, like, it's, it's okay if I get hit by that. It's okay if I get hit by that, but it's everything else. And this guy has a lot of... Of health, it, it's either that or I'm not doing any damage. But I'm not gonna keep trying this. I'm not gonna waste your time. I'm not gonna waste my time. We'll, we'll come back to this when we get some better stuff. This dude's a, a one shot for us right now. We're on the outside looking in. I'm gonna walk away from this. So we'll come back later. But anyway, we got the rest. See, like this isn't even a necessary dungeon. I don't think. Like, it's, that's, that's where it, it starts to get like, oh, well, how much of this game do you really want to do? Because this isn't even necessary, and we're wasting all this time. Can I climb up the wall? Yes. Yes, I can. But I can't jump over there. I can't jump over there. But I can't jump over there. Ah! So I have to get up there from here somehow. And this is where it becomes Legend of Zelda. Maybe. Oh, I got it. I got it. Yep, I got it. Yep, just that easy. One of those little things, you know, that you never. And that was it. Was just that simple. Book, Book of the Dead page, just like that. Volgrim's gonna be so happy with us. Oh God. <laughs> anyway, let's get the rest of these treasure chests and go outside and get that last or that. Uh, Ferryman thing. I don't even know what those do. I completely forget what those do in this game. Oh boy. How am I supposed to get over there? A jump, of course. So, when in doubt, just jump. Might as well jump. Jump! Go ahead and jump. I may not be able to do anything with that, though. That, that's the thing. Like, it may just be... I may need a piece of equipment. Yeah. Well, hang on, partner. Let me take a look around here, see what I can find. Might find uh, your mother's phone number back here. You never know. Anyway. Could I possibly grab... Uh, I was thinking for a second. He could probably climb any wall he wanted to. Like, see how those pillars have kind of lips right there? I'm thinking you can grab onto those, but I don't know how I would get up there in the first place. Like, if I could just run up this right here, which I can't. Can I run up this? Yeah, but... Um... Or if I had two walls facing each other, I could run up one of them and keep jumping back and forth, but... So I can't do that here. Can't do that here. 
Dang it, war. Why can't you just have wings? Oh, dang it, death. Why can't you just have wings like war? This is how we get out. So I guess falling down there isn't advantageous. Excuse me. Don't kick the wall, man. Hey, don't poke the bear, buddy. Oh, if I poke a bear, a bear would be mauling me. Ooh. That's just how we get over there to, to open this door. This game is confusing. We're not even doing a dungeon yet. We're not even going after anything. Just screwing around, man. Excuse me, what was that? Hmm. I don't want to linger here too long. We've already spent pretty much an entire video here. But I would like to know how to get over there. So like that, that over there. Like what's that back there? And how in the world would I even get over there? See, like there's things to hang from. So I'm thinking I can't even do this yet because you gotta have whatever, like a grappling hook or something. But maybe or or am I making any ground with this? I think I am. Oh, I was. Oh, I can't, I can't get past that. I can't get, God, I can't get past that lip for some reason. Oh, what? He just holds on or what? Oh, that, oh, that's where we came from. Never mind, I was about to get, get excited. Can he jump to the side, though? Like, when he's lingering like that, can he just, like, jump any direction? No, he literally has to jump backwards. Huh. Alright, well, we've wasted enough time. Unless there's something under here. Sorry, the, the Indiana Jones that, you know, lives in, inside me just says, Explore this, it'll be fun. And then I usually end up dying and jumping back in the water. At least he doesn't take fall damage, that's good news. But anyway, what are you cats and kids been up to? Like, am I hanging out? And rock Anybody else playing this game right now? Or am I the only person in the world that's playing this game? And let's go meet my favorite character, once again. Hello, my friend. Hello. Over here. What is going on? Greetings, Horseman. And welcome. I've been expecting you. Vulgrim. What brings you crawling out of the shadows? <laughs> I wouldn't want to lose my most valuable customer. <laughs> Not to what lurks at the edge of shadows. So here I am to offer my way. Of course you are. What do you know that I don't? I'm not here by choice, demon. I merely followed the trail of carnage. <laughs> Your blades are as sharp as ever. Even still, I may be able to help you. I carry things others would. Round What's that? Porn? Go on. Take a look. You won't be disappointed. Mm, okay. What you got, Volley? I have new items. Respect. Oh, we're not doing that. Yet. Gilded box. I can take random enchant. Oh boy, loot boxes once again. <laughs> Welcome back to EA's bestseller. Okay, we get rid of the size, even though that's his original size. A bargain. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be doing that. Actually, that's better than the one I have. Not selling that, because eventually I'll be able to use those. Get this. Get this. Keep those. I can't, yeah, I, I, can, I, got, I can only sell a chapter. Get rid of this. Now I'm going to switch. Time, demon. I'm gonna switch because I didn't. Then, I didn't make the connection that the damage was the same, but it had more. There are pages missing from the Book of the Dead. I believe many lie along your path. The Necronomicon. If you bring them to me, your reward will be substantial. Money. And so will be my damnation. Ooh. That's heavy. You gotta think, like, if these creatures actually exist and, like, they are aware of each other, they would probably, like, like, how would they talk? Is this, like, how they would talk to each other? Like, that's what I'm trying to think. Like, that's what I mean by the whole lore. Like, if these 
creatures came in contact with each other in this wave, is this exactly how this would play out? Would there actually be merchants like this? It just blow my mind. If it just blow my mind. All right, let's go to our first dungeon. The Weeping Crag. Interesting. Oh man, it's about to get real. I think I gotta be back here so soon. Bane wood, excuse me. What is in here? Oh, 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 oh. Let's see how this thing is. Ooh! Extra critical damage for the win. Or critical chance, rather. Either way, it's good enough for me. If it murders, I want it. Alright. In this game, not in real life. I don't condone violence. <laughs> oh, boots, huh? These boots are made for walking. And that's just what they'll do. Jessica Simpson. One of these days. Wait, what is that? What? No, what is that? Right there. There's some things in this game that I just remembered. That you have to shoot, and they're like a collectible. And, which is fine, I just got all the holocrons and forced to unleash two yesterday. But, that's okay, it's a fun game. And see, now this is where I forget where I am. I'm going to show you guys the map, and it's a little bit overwhelming, to say the least. Uh, and this is just the first map, okay? This, they're... Yeah, there's, there's a lot to this. Now, granted, there's only like one beaded path. Don't get me wrong. Like here, like here's where the forge was. This is where we were. Then they opened the door here, and we went up there. Then oh, and here's that big open area. And this is how we get. That's where that big eyeball creature thing is, that leads all the way up to the tree. And then that was the left side, and we went to the right side because that's the only way we can go right now. And we just passed through, and now here in the Weeping Craig in Baneswood, and there's Volgrim where he was. And, and I think here's where our first dungeon is, or right here's where our first dungeon is, Lost Temple. Um, but then, like, it goes all the way down here, the Charred Pass. Oh, actually, that's where we need to go. It's down the Charred Pass. So I'm probably going to avoid this. Like, I'll check out this area and see what's in here, but we're not going to be able to go here yet, probably. So, so without further ado, let's, let's go ahead, see what we can find, see what damage we can cause, partner. Oh, look, another one. Oh, piece of candy. Give, give, give. I realize it's just wrath, but it's, like, well, it's not just wrath. It's actually a super weapon. It's not a super weapon. It does do a lot more damage, though. I, I will give it that. Then this is one of the games that I was totally thinking about. Or not thinking about, but I was just thinking about this in the game. You need to wait till right before you get hit before you dodge because the enemies will follow you. They got like a delayed kind of... I guess it's a response is what it is. They got a, a delayed response to like when you move. So like if you dodge too early, they will recorrect their strike and they will hit you. That's one of those uh, wait until the last minute things, which is fine. You know, so we, can, we can work our way around that. Uh, but when I'm picking up items, I appreciate people not attacking me. We got a super, or not a super weapon now. Like, I don't really know. That's the thing about this game. I, it's, it's, it is a random drop game. But I'm sure there's certain items in the game that are exceptionally special. Like, actual super items. Actual special items. And I have no idea where they are. I haven't the foggiest idea where I would find, like, let's say... Man, that, that was a screw me moment. I couldn't, I couldn't drop down. I don't know where I would find those kinds of weapons. And I've never known where, where I could find those weapons. Probably gotta have some kind of something here. Probably can't just jump up there like a normal human being would. Or whatever death is. Hmm. Well, I gotta get up there somehow. Probably need some kind of hook shot or something. Nope, don't need it. All right, and we jump over here, and we do a loop-de-loop -loop and pull, 
And our shoes are looking cool, you dig? See, si, senor. Anyway. Ah, we made it! More stuff. Talisman, is it a good one? Got more experience, but... Oh, well, that would actually be useful as far as... The There's another one of those things I gotta shoot, but I don't get my gun until later. Um... Yeah, I, whenever I play games that are, and play games that are like RPG like this, for instance, uh, I think Borderlands had something like this. Whenever they have items that can grant you more experience, like, oh no, it's Friday the 13th that has it. Uh, they got a perk on there that can give you more experience, like 3% or something like that, 5%, which over time is a lot of experience, you know what I mean? And I always try to go for items like that, especially early on in the game, just to get kind of like a head start and stuff. But I mean, I realize, like, when it comes to, like, doing boss battles or something, you, you want to... Oh, that was a quick attack. Good job. Like, you don't want to have that stuff equipped. You only want to have that stuff equipped when it actually helps, I guess. Like, whenever you're grinding out, like, killing enemies like this to get, like, a little bit of XP, having that extra... XP boost on is more valuable than having that. Well, then again, killing a boss would give you more XP, and if it works on like a percentage basis, you'd want to have that on when you kill the boss. That way, you got the best, the most out of that. But then again, I, I don't know. It depends on how you want to do it. You want to go into a battle with more damage or potential to make more experience. And I've always favored experience, personally, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know why I always have. Probably always have and always will, but, uh... I just, I feel like whenever you, no you, you level up us. as a character, it's always gonna be more valuable than having just, like, a really strong weapon. You know what I mean? I've always felt like that was important, but I, I may be completely wrong. I mean, there's obviously certain, uh, weapons in games that break that. You know, if you were, let's say you did max out your character and then you got the strongest weapon, well then there's nothing that can really stop you. But I would rather have a stronger character than a stronger weapon. Because I feel like it, that makes it more skill-based, I suppose. It's our friend. It's our friend, he's not killing us. There's always favored stuff that... Or favorite, I've always favored a way of playing that catered more towards, like, skill-based stuff. I would rather do something in a game that made me a better player versus just made me stronger. You know what I mean? Like, I, like train to learn how to dodge or train to learn a new uh, technique. Not another one. <laughs> Sorry, you're war. the Nephilim. Death. The one they call Death. How did you get here? I was born. Took a wrong turn. Ooh. It appears I'm stranded here with the rest of you. If you seek the cauldron, you should know that it fell to corruption fair long ago. I can still feel the fire itself rumbling deep in the earth. I take I'll it. take my chances. What's shaman? The shaman has offered me a talisman if I bring her the materials. You'd be wise to accept then. Her craft is mighty powerful. Where do I find Stalker's bone? You'll find Stalker's prowling the cauldron. Should be simple work if your name is any indication. <laughs> You're different than the others. Less pleasant on the eyes, for one. Ooh. <laughs> I could say no less for you. Ooh. Folks around town call me Pup or Lad, but I prefer my own name. What's up, Karn? Pup, it is, then. Oh. As you will. Matters not to me. Well, all right. Why not restore the fire yourself? I came here just for that purpose. Figured I'd pop the cork, so to speak. Hmm. Be the hero. But oh, the cauldron is intentions. locked up well and tight. And the way through is swallowed by fire. No, not fire. You look capable enough. Perhaps you can find a way. I'll wait here and guard the entrance. And just like that, we got handed the the huge task of what he came here to do. Thank you, Muchus Como. You dig? Anyway. 
What else we gonna do? Dude, I haven't watched a lot of movies. I started watching a bit of Fry and Lori again. Hey, we got some shoulder stuff now. Wrong button. Well, the right button just not held long enough. Oh, get us some... Sh what? 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 I didn't want to do that. I wanted to pick up the thing. Did I do it? No, I didn't. <laughs> Still gotta get used to this game. Kinda, it's, it feels almost like... The Force Unleashed, because everything's kind of delayed a little bit. I don't know really how to explain that, but the Zeti's okay. It does more critical, okay. Pauldron, there we are, that's it. Or shoulders, whatever, whatever they call it in this game. It, it matters not. Uh, everything's the same. Uh, same, I guess. Uh, that's equipped. What we've got is good, and okay. Alright, so we're making our way, we're making our way up in this world. We're, we're scratching and clawing, trying to get a little bit of traction here. I think we got it. We definitely got it. What games have you guys been playing? I have no idea. I don't even know what... I mean, I'm seriously... I'm just waiting for Far Cry 5, waiting for Dark Side of Story, waiting for Red Dead Redemption 2. But uh, I have seriously... I have played more games the last couple weeks than I have in a long time. And I was thinking about this the other day. Like, when I was a kid, I mean, obviously, all I had was school. I didn't have a job or anything like that. But, uh, when I was a kid, like, between PlayStation 2, original Xbox, and GameCube, I didn't have a lot of games. I think I added it up one day, and it was somewhere near, like, it was between 25 and 35 games in total across all those systems. Now, that's not a lot of games. For a kid, yeah, that's a lot of games. But the fact is, I played those games more than I have played anything in the last 10 years, give or take. Now, I did play Modern Warfare, to, or COD 4, Modern Warfare a lot, played Modern Warfare 2 a lot, but I just, it's hard for me to grasp. Like, whenever I was a kid and I had. Like, those few games, I played those more than I played any other game in the last few years. on stream of life. Can we destroy certain objects and dislodge others? Can I use it to... Okay, well, I'm just going to do that. To hit that, and it will bounce that thing back. Oh, my goodness. Well, that's a game mechanic you don't see very often. Well, maybe. Can I use it to break things? That is my next question. Will it blow up in my hands? is another question. It's not looking like it will. Good. It waits until it gets thrown. That's good news. Unlike it was in Darksiders 1 that you only have a matter of time. And that's a lot better. I'll take that shroud. Thank you. Can't dodge in the air, though. I've got used to that with the uh, Force Unleashed. Dodging in the air. Oh, God! Oh, God! Ah! I was going to attack. I was about to panic. Very kind of them to not, uh, better, better. I probably don't get. I mean, is it better or is it? Just thing. Like I don't know if, like the one I'm wearing now has some kind of like bonus to it. I'm thinking it does. Yeah, it's got resistance added to it. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I think I'm gonna keep that resistance. I'm gonna keep it. Keep it. All right. Now what's over? I probably can't go over there just yet. Probably not. That's probably the way back. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely the way back. Ah, yes, the door there. It's a clearer indication, you know, with my knowledge of this dungeon, it being what it is. Clearly, that door is the way. <laughs> you show me the way, the door is the way. But anyway, this is the first real temple dungeon thing, ladies and gentlemen. It's not too bad from what I remember. I, I, uh... I remember the... I think there's like two bosses, though. If I remember correctly. I think there's like two bosses. There's like a halfway boss, and then there's like the actual end of the dungeon where you get the fire on the mountain and bring it back to the forge. But for some reason, I remember the majority of the game being trying to get the fire and the tears. I, that's what I remember the most about this game. I feel like that took me the most out of everything. This is not the way to go. Or am I supposed to jump back? 
I was supposed Hey! You used your brain! Achievement unlocked! And then you just killed yourself. <laughs> Good job. Good thing we can fly, huh? Be bad news if we could. <gasps> LOL. Hashtag Darksiders 1. How am I gonna get over there? Obviously, gotta dislodge that. Clear. Oh, oh, I found it. I found it. When in doubt, fight gravity. I always say. Said that for years. All right. So, I'm supposed to just jump there, maybe? Whoop. Yes. We oui, we. Oui. Do you? Th I mean, obviously, the, the horsemen are wise people. You know. You know what I mean? Like, well, they're not people. First of all. Oh, well, that was kind of racist. Uh, they're not people, <laughs> but there's some kind of other. Oh, I just screwed that up. I thought for sure I needed to drop down, but I needed to run over and then drop down. Um, they probably know a thing or two. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like they probably know a lot. I mean, personally, I probably wouldn't hang out with them. You know, because I would probably be. Probably be more afraid of what they might say. Bring about, you know, real revelations of the world and stuff. Like, I probably don't want to... I don't want to know too much. <laughs> but at the same time, I... Uh, at the same time, they would probably have a lot to say. Like, a lot of... And that was the worst shot! That thing's not even moving! Right, here we go, here we go. Uh, there. Dislodged. Disqualified, as David Bowie would say. Bowie, Bowie. <gasps> Wherever you're from and however you pronounce his name. Both ways are correct, I suppose. I can't go over there yet. Alright. So, as I was saying, it's about time for a mini boss, I think. Feels like it. Oh. Oh, he's a big one. And he's got... Well, is he a big one? Kind of, not really. No, he's not. He's a little baby like the rest of these guys. I've already killed him. Threw him right in the fire, dude. That's what he gets. Thinking he could best me. I am death itself, Parker. There is no escaping me. If you don't die by my hands now, eventually you will. Now may not be your time. But eventually, we will meet each other again. There's no way to block in this game. And that kind of bothers me. Coming from, you know, like Mortal Kombat and stuff like that, not being able to block kind of bothers me. I mean, just a, like a little bit. You know, it's like one of those things like, oh, you just got to get used to it, you know? I think I'm going to turn on auto collect. Well, no, no, I'm not. Because what it'll do, it'll, it'll probably pick up everything automatically and I don't want to pick up everything automatically if I can just straight equip it, you know? Just makes sense to me. I'd love to see some speed runs of this game. You know, I've never thought about it. Like I wanna know if there's like some glitches in this game that you can really utilize. Oh boy. Oh, oh hey, well, why would I just I just let them duke it out, you know? You guys go ahead and fight amongst yourself. Right? Actually, well, death is kind of my job, so I guess, uh... See the way this goes down, I'm gonna be playing. Bro, dodge! Oh. Sometimes locking on is good, sometimes locking on is uh, not so good. Because it's hard to see, like, when people are gonna be damaging you. Do these guys just come back to life for eternity, or what? This I don't know. I can't, I can't see the future that far, or in that much detail. Arcane critical? Ah, okay. Oh, I mean, I'll pick them up. <laughs> no, do not pick them up. That's money in the back in the bank, dude. Oh, but that was just better. All around better. <gasps> I literally could have just bypassed that entire fight. Oh, that wasn't really a fight. It was intervention. Oh, another key. Wee oui, wee. Oui. The key I see. All right. Time to unlock some doors. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know. What you're no, definitely, definitely not time for that. That's probably never gonna happen in my life. Oh. I do need to know, like, for Rizzle Dizzles, what the cooldown on the dodging is. 
Probably something like... Take like a step or two or something and... And then it'll reset. You know what I mean? You know how sometimes they, they do that? Oh, look! Oh, great! Oh, look! A, an undead monkey! A dead horseman. That is what that is. As far as movies go, I haven't watched any movies. I finished, told you guys, I finished John Wick. Uh, Doug got me the first two seasons of Roseanne. I finished that yesterday. Um, they're adding stuff on Netflix all the time, but I haven't seen a movie that I've liked yet. Yet to find one of those. Maybe someday they'll put something on there actually worth watching. Oh! No, I mean, there's a lot of stuff on there worth watching, but I'm just... I mean, as of right now, I've pretty much seen everything I want to see. Now, this sucks. It's going to be one of those, huh? There's portal all over it. Instead of cubes, it's balls. What a bunch of balls, man. Well, not yet. But I forgot that was like this. Oh, oh, give me that. I want that. I want it! Um... I don't know what those do. I've completely forget what they do. Hmm. So anyway, but started watching Fry and Lori again, which is best show ever created, ever. <gasps> and it was made by British land of all places, which is fine with me. You know, it's no, no big deal. I'm part British. We're all part British, <laughs> ultimately. <gasps> but uh. Well, Native American and British. Well, there's still some Native, like pure American, Native Americans around. But just for the, the sake of the argument, there's a lot of people came from English land, which is fine. But, uh. Dude, what do you think stuff was like, baby? Like, what if I was to get in a time machine and take, like, the PlayStation 4's virtual reality and show people that? What do you think? would happen. They would lose their minds, man. Witchcraft. I'd be burned at the stake for witchcraft, probably. Wait, no! This is the future! It's not witchcraft, really! But they wouldn't believe me. I would just tell them that I came from a land down under. They hadn't found Australia right by that time, had they? Was Australia even around back when the Native Americans were hanging around? Oh, look. Back to square one. I told you that told you. I told you that. I told you that door had to do with that. But now it says I can. Oh, oh, yep. I was say I was, I was trying to look up for something, but I was trying to find a hole in the wall. If you're gonna blow holes in the wall. It'll be worth it for God's sakes, Ernie. Just give me the gun. Think of the money. <laughs> That's a pest movie, man. Anybody ever gets a chance to? Oh, I just came from here. Sorry, sorry. My bad. I was thinking about it in an anti uh, forward thinking way. So a reverse thinking way? Yes, exactly. But my way sounds better. Hmm. Oh god. He almost blended in with the background. I almost didn't see him. Anyway. Where am I going? Like what am I doing? Have I been here before? No, I don't think so. No, I have not. Balls! That's what we're doing. Balls, that's right. I remember now. Anyway. I like how, for now, like, your attacks cancel other people's attacks. That's... That's always nice. I know I said that in, like, the first episode, but it's still nice. Alright, we gotta... I was say, we need to find a way to destroy thine corruption. Well, sometimes, in order to destroy corruption, you must corrupt it with something else. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about. Can I kick this thing? Ah, yeah, I knew there was a way. Dang right. Probably gonna have to utilize that. And I'm, I've never been a good shot, ever, with anything. I cannot shoot a gun to save my life. Handgun, that is. I'm not bad with a rifle, but just anything else. Terrible. Um, well, maybe not a shotgun at point blank, but that's beside the point. What is this? Shadow bomb dislodge. Shadow bombs explode. Devastating force. Anything blast radius will be blown will be blown away or destroyed. The force of the bomb can use to move large objects. Okay. 
Oh. Oh. Okay, I got you. I got you, game. I see what you're doing here. Let's dislodge this. And... Oh. Well, we didn't need to dislodge it, but... I get, Okay, well, I guess the game was just showing me... Or maybe we did. Oh, we need to open that. Like, maybe putting that ball in there. Oh, no, 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 no. Nine, 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 Just think about this in a communist way, and it'll be fine. Wait a minute. Wait. Oh, you did need to dislodge it. Ah! Oh, I didn't know. This. I didn't know there was another one over there. Come on, cut me a break. I didn't know. I didn't know. I just started playing this game today. Come on. Oh, but there's a th Oh, you... Oh, you... Oh. Oh, if I knew the word I was trying to think of right now. Oh, my God. Another Book of the Dead page. See, I don't know how much money he gives for it. Like, I don't remember him giving an item. He might, like, if you collect the entire book. I don't know how many chapters are in it. But maybe if you collect the entire book, he may give you an item. But I think it's mostly just money. For the most part... Let's see if we can knock this thing right into the hole. Whoa! No. No, we cannot. We actually put it back where we found it, which is a good thing. Shows I have some manners, not a lot, but some. I'm a human being. Which means I'm, I'm, only, I'm only so... I can only be that so awesome. You know? Happy Valentine's Day, by the way, ladies and Sorry, I missed it. Uh, and by the time this video goes up, oh God, there's no telling when this video is gonna go up. I have no idea. But uh, probably sometime next week, because I still got four episodes. Well, no, two episodes. I only have two episodes left of Dark Siders ones. I uh, maybe up before before the weekend, maybe. Hopefully, I mean, it's just Monday today. So. But anyway, trying to keep a. A weather eye on the horizon for the, the clock that has run out of time. Thank you for watching. Like, keep it real. Keep it. We're going to see what's beyond this door in the next episode. It was a pleasure. Keep it real and peace.